Wow, here it is. Eligard's Redstone Laboratory. Seems more like an entrance or a foyer or something. Don't worry, pal. We'll find her. I just hope she can actually help us. Redstone stuff I've ever seen in my life. You can say that again. Come on, let's keep moving. What are those things even for? Maybe, I don't know, breaking things up, keeping intruders out. There are lots of possibilities. Okay, almost. Definitely a step in the right direction. Ah! Nicely done, Jesse. You're pretty good at this. Hey, what can I say? Me and the Redstone just speak to each other. Uh huh. She's moving a lot of different ingredients around here. Man. Look at all this, huh? Whatever she's working on, if it requires all of these ingredients. Now, I don't want to alarm you, Olivia, but I have no idea what I'm looking at here. I don't know what it is yet either. That's why I'm studying it. Come on, let's keep moving. Awesome. Like I dreamt it. Entering Eligard's laboratory, seeing her right there. She'll ask me to be her apprentice, and the next thing you know, we'll be changing the world together. Let's just try to save the world first. Time to pace back and forth and check the systems. Inventory request. Operational. Delivery latency? Speak Whoa! Hi! Hey! Didn't see you sneaking up on me. <laughs> yes, that's the point. Don't touch anything in here, okay? It's all supremely fragile and genius. Did Calvin send you? You my new assistants? New assistants with a stupidly <laughs> adorable pig, that is. <laughs> Eligard! No time for specifics, I'm afraid. Hey, you. Goggle girl. Switch on that T-flop circuit to activate the delivery chutes. And you, non-goggle guy? Grab me a blaze rod and an iron block. She wants me to do something for her. What if I screw it up? What if I... Oh, I feel lightheaded. Wow, now I need an assistant to help with my assistant. Think you can handle it on your own? Okay, delivery circuit is on. Blaze rod, iron block.
Uh, Miss Eligard? Yes? I'm very sorry, but I'm sort of concentrating on something here. Hence the dome of... Anyway. I could really use your help. Oh, you can get it. Just turn on the delivery system circuit, then choose what you want. One blaze rod, one iron block. Please. Wow, a blaze rod. It's all tingly. Just what the engineer ordered. Uh, Eligard? I got those things you asked for. Ah, excellent. Fantastic. Love it. Always happy to have a capable set of hands around. Carrying materials, disposing of fainted assistants. <laughs> you know, that sort of thing. Number 6,451. Another bust. Now, about you three. Excuse me? Excuse me. Could you please not lie on my floor anymore? Someone's gonna trip over you while carrying lava, and it's gonna be such a mess. Lava everywhere. And boy, nothing gets lava out. Nothing. Except more lava. I don't think that I've ever fainted before. I was just so excited to meet you, and... And with me always pacing around, lost in my own brilliant thoughts. Eligard, we've actually got much bigger problems to deal with. We're actually here to get your help. There's a giant wither storm, and it's attacking the entire world. A wither what? What are you talking about? Who, who sent you? Was it Calvin? You know about Ivor? He's created a terrible monster. Look, you both seem like very pleasant people who are prone to fainting, but I simply don't have the brain power for this. I'm in the middle of my greatest project to date. A powerful block capable of altering reality itself. Ooh, I'm so close I can practically taste it. And it tastes like victory. I've seen one of those before. It's a command block. Wait, 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 wait. How do you know what a command block is? Not to seem belittling, but we are talking about some mega, ultra-genius level stuff here. We've seen one up close before. It was Ivor's. He's done something terrible with it. The world needs the Order of the Stone. That's why we're here. Ugh, sorry to bust your circuits, but the Order isn't really together anymore. We, uh, sort of disassembled. That's actually kind of why we're here. Gabriel's amulet. This certainly changes things. Yes. He gave it to me to find the order. It's how we found you. Yes. This is serious indeed. All the more reason why I need to finish my command block. I can use it to fight this witherstorm monster thing or whatever. Necessity is the originator of invention. And that monster is my necessity for inventing, of which I am the originator. Is that even possible? Can you really do that? This is THE Eligard you're talking to. Who is... Me? If you're confused. And I, Eligard, will make a command block TODAY! Your Witherstorm problem was created by a command block, yes? That means a command block could be the perfect way of beating it. And maybe... Will you help me make one? It's going to work this time. I can feel it. You're the genius, Eligard. Let's get started. Fantastic.
exciting. Has it gotten this far before? No, never! Is it destabilizing? you're back and we brought Eligard fantastic quick come on you guys are never gonna believe who showed up while you were gone Petra hey guys how's it going I'm so glad you're okay Petra yeah I'm pretty stoked about it myself it's really good to see you, Jesse. Back there in Gabriel's bunker, it got pretty dicey. It's such a relief to see you. I'm glad you're okay. You pulled me out of that Witherstorm's crutches, and I ran and ran and ran for the temple. If you hadn't saved me, well, I owe you everything, Jesse. I'm just glad I heard Gabriel telling you where to go. Wow. Did Gabriel get away too? Did you see? It's all a blur, but the weather storm left almost nothing behind. Everything, everyone, was just gone. It even caught Gabriel. I wouldn't believe that anything could defeat Gabriel if I hadn't seen it for myself. This is terrible. Boy, can't remember the last time I saw this place. Would someone care to explain what he is doing here? Call this a hunch, but do you two not like each other? Right. I forgot to mention. Axel went on a little... adventure of his own while you were gone. An adventure to get him? Did you know about this? Why didn't you tell me? You did this on purpose. Hey! Axel's my friend, okay? I didn't know he was going to get Magnus. You gotta believe me. Well, I hope you're not expecting me to work with that cretin. Look, just wait here a second while I figure out what's going on. Much appreciated. So, who are you then? And why'd you bring the Queen of the Nerds with you? That's Jesse, my best friend. 
Trust me, Jessie's totally cool. Hey, Eligard is cool. And she's going to help stop this wither storm. Ellie? <laughs> cool? <laughs> oh, uh, oh, wait, 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 you're serious? Oh, wow, that's, uh, that's, uh, woo, ha, oh, boy. I got tired of waiting around, so I decided to go recruit Magnus myself. It was kind of a crazy adventure, but it all worked out in the end. And now, I'm the king of Boomtown. Ah! We've been bonding and stuff. I've had, like, the best day. It was so cool. I had to beat him in a crazy tournament, and... Long story, you had to beat him. Short version, epic battle of explosions and mayhem, death-defying action, shenanigans, and pyrotechnics. Bada-bing, bada-boom! Your friend here is kind of supreme ruler of my kingdom now, you know what I mean? Well, this is unexpected. I'm not entirely sure what you mean, but I'm definitely sure that I don't like it. Yeah, show him some respect. Oh, you're sticking up for Magnus, that's very... sweet. Yeah, he's sticking up for me. It's because I'm really awesome and super cool. Eligard, come on. I know this isn't how the plan was supposed to go, but it's going to be fine. Ha! Fine. Uh, people, can we please focus on the bigger picture? We have a very hungry Witherstorm in the process of turning the whole world into its dinner. It was terrifying. It came out of nowhere and just destroyed everything. A little too scary for you, Ellie? Couldn't just think it away? You weren't there, Magnus. I'm telling you, this thing was like nothing I've ever seen. Hey! Hey! Yes, it's scary. But it's nothing we can't handle, all right? We're gonna do this. Okay? How? Jesse's right. We need to find some way to stop that thing. Well, I don't know if you've had the chance to poke around this old dump yet, but it's pretty much stripped bare. It would take a mountain of TNT to kill that thing. I hate to say it, but you have a point. This is amazing. I know. Are they getting along? Magnus, I thought of something. Ugh, thinking. What else is new with you? But against such an unthinkable enemy, even all the TNT in the world might not be enough. If only Soren were here, he might have something we could use. Oh, Ellie, not this again. You know I hate when you brag about you and Soren's little brainy club. I'm not bragging. I think I've got a legitimate idea here. What are you talking about? What did Soren have? Soren had a kind of super TNT. Stronger and more explosive than anything else in the world. The Formidabomb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard all about the F-bomb before. F-bomb? Yeah. Soren claimed that dropping the F-bomb could destroy anything. Do you know where it is? Can we get some? Well, there's a little problem there. We don't know where Soren is. But you found us. Do you know where he is? Our map could locate him. Unless he's in the nether, or the end. But it's worth a shot. I bet we can find him. Your light, my light. That's new. There he is. Soren had his fortress deep inside the mountains. After the order broke up, that's where he went to keep doing his experiments. Look, he invited me there a couple times, but it always seemed a little weird, right? It always seemed a little weird. 
glad we can agree on that at any rate. So he'll help us, right? Whoa. It didn't do that before. Are you sure it's working? Blue. Blue! That's Ivor! Ivor is going to Soren's. We need to move. It's not too far. We could probably make it on foot. Righteous. We'll get some rest and head out first thing in the morning. Avoiding all the nighttime monsters and everything. If you had seen that monster, you wouldn't be saying that. We need to leave now. I think it's following us, Magnus. And I don't want to risk it catching up with us. We have to go now. Yeah. I don't want the Witherstorm catching up with us. We should go now. An excellent call, Jesse. And far more decisive than either of us are being. What a coincidence that it's your plan. But fine. Okay, everyone, let's get moving. Yo, we haven't really gotten a chance to chat yet. Oh, hello. I heard you saved your friend back there from this Witherstorm thing. You're pretty tough, huh? A regular iron golem, huh? Leaving the creepers quaking in their boots. Yeah, I am pretty tough. Looking for a fight? Whoa, easy slugger. You got moxie. I like that. I kinda wish you had my back before, but whatever, still seem alright, ish. What's the deal with your buddy Axel? Can't tell if he's awesome, or a little bit of a dork. He's just a little, uh, doofy, you know? To be honest, he's been kind of annoying me lately. All the fighting, all the negativity. Yeah? That's why you didn't listen to his plan to come get me? Was I just not your cup of tea, or didn't think you could handle it? I do have that effect on people sometimes. I don't know, I just wanted to go with Olivia instead, I guess. Uh-huh, uh-huh, I guess that's fair. Sort of. <laughs> I'll try not to let it hurt my feelings too much. Well, just keep on your toes. I said we should have waited till morning. We wouldn't need to worry about any of this crap. At least we're keeping ahead of the wither storm. Well, we can hash that out later, because we've got some monsters to fight here, people. Daytime. How far is Soren? It has to be close, right? Not much farther. We can make it. Yeah, and I'm really not feeling those columns. 
Ah, oh, come on! It's fine! Look! Woo! and thought I would come down to help. <laughs> Endermen. There's so many. I didn't think they ever came in groups that big. That was pretty reckless, Lucas. You could have gotten hurt. walks away. That's it. I'm going. See? I'm walking away too now. Super TNT. Here I come. It's hard to pick glass half full when they keep kicking the glass over. And I thought they were doing so well. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far. Bickering is kind of their deal. But hopefully they'll work things out and get on with the important stuff. What are we gonna do now? Where should we go? Let's figure it out. Guard the engineer. Gabriel the warrior. Hey, Petra. Hey. You okay? Jesse? Yeah? It's Petra. She... I don't know. Doesn't seem right. I tried asking, but she... Well, maybe she'll talk to you? Okay. I'm sorry. I don't mean to worry you. I've just got something I want to discuss with you in private. But let's split up. I feel bad about ditching everyone else, but I just wanted to talk to you about this alone. It's a little tough to talk about. Hey, whatever it is, I trust you. You can tell me. 
Thanks for being so understanding. You got me away from the wither storm. But I'm worried that I didn't get away soon enough. What? It showed up not too long after you saved me. Holy crap. What are we doing down here? We need to get you help. I don't know if there's anything we can do, Jesse. Do you know what Wither is? The Wither? Of course, we've been- No, Jesse. Just Wither. Or Wither Sickness, I guess. And I feel like it's just gonna keep getting worse. Well, we're going to go back and tell the others. We can get help! You can't tell anyone about this. <gasps> ah! Creeper! Grab my hand, I'll pull you up. <clears throat> Jesse, I just couldn't. I'm sorry. Jesse? Don't worry. I'm fine. Okay, I got this. Stay safe. I'll find a way down to you. Must have something useful in here. He has to. Hey, show yourself. Who's there? <gasps> you. Trying to interfere with my plans again, I see. Your tenacity is commendable, yet misguided. I found the rest of the Order. What good will that do? I'm here with the Order to find Soren Super TNT. We are going to take down your Witherstorm. The Order? <laughs> Believe me. That plan will blow up in their faces in more ways than one. They cannot help you. But me? I choose not to. Out of my way. Sorry, Ivor. I'm... Oh, you're not going anywhere. <laughs> Petra, you escaped? <laughs> ah! Foolish girl! 
girl! I... Shut up. I don't care what you have to say. I'm just gonna take you down. I'm not letting you leave either. Good. I'm the only one who can stop the wither storm! Not you, not the order! Don't make yourselves the villains in my story. You're not going anywhere. Ah! This could have all been avoided. If you want to stop me, you'll have to catch me first. Jesse, look out! You're not getting out of here that easy, Ivor. <laughs> uh, I'm like the wind! Jesse, you could have just let me go. <laughs> now you see me. Now you. <laughs> it's one of his invisibility potions. He could be anywhere. Vanish all you want, slime ball. You're still not going anywhere. <laughs> End of the rail, Ivor. We're not letting you get away. One's on you, you puffed up fool! Stopped him. Jesse did, anyway. False. You have stopped nothing. A query. Have you ever seen the effects of a splash potion of slowness? What? That they can destroy the Wither Storm? But they are mistaken, and it will cost them their lives. Next time on Minecraft Story Mode. In pursuit of answers, all our heroes found in Sauron's armory was deceit and treachery. Locked in a dark chamber deep in Sauron's mountain, as the Order of the Stone rides off towards near certain doom, our heroes must ask themselves, would they find a way out of this dark tomb? Is there any way to cure Petra's wither sickness? Would they find a way to defeat the wither storm? Or will they remain trapped as it continues its ravenous rampage across the entire world? Only time will tell. <laughs>